I kind of feel like one of those parents that dumps their kid at an orphanage around the age of three and then resurfaces again come college graduation time going, Hey, what have you been up to for the past 18 years? What's going on, people? This is Russian Freako9, aka Savage from Team Crossroads, and this is a really quick update video. Really quick is an understatement because the damn thing's about nine minutes something seconds long, so that's pretty long, but I don't like to make videos like this where I ramble on about the channel and, you know, I don't give you any informative entertainment about the game um, because, you know, that's sort of what the channel's for, but so much has changed that an update is kind of in order, so. Quick word about the background, it's going to be some Project Cars, Rocket League, and F1 gameplay. Really kind of intense stuff, I wanted to upload some decent clips. Um, so if you like anything that you see in the background, let me know. Um, I'm not really considering doing Project Cars so much, but if you're interested in gameplay where there's really intense battles with AI where I don't get taken out every other corner, um, you know, let me know. The game's a year old, but I'll consider making videos on it if people are actually interested. So, and then, you know, there's going to be some F1 where I cut some corners ferociously through Canada. It's going to be great. Um, so, main, um, main focus is, though, to update you guys on the channel. So, about a year ago, when I last was making, doing any kind of activity on YouTube, um, I was making my R34 video for the crew, and then it just disappeared for a solid year, and there's pretty good reasons behind that. Um, and that is essentially, one, the crew became complete garbage. I literally mean like three days after I uploaded that video, they released the update with the Abarth. And when Mini Coopers and Fiats begin to be faster than R34s in any kind of racing game, that's when I put down the wheel controller and or keyboard and mouse and say, you know what, I don't want to be wasting my time on this. So I, that's exactly what I did. I don't think I'll be able to ever go back to that game again. Also, as you, some of you may know, I'm a full-time student in college, and um, that's hard enough as it is, given the fact that, uh, given the nature of my major. And also, I was working a part-time job. Well, I managed to add another part-time job to that list of activities and uh, commitments, so that already began to fill up my schedule. Not to mention the fact that for the second part-time job, I also make videos and articles. So, it's um, it kind of began to dominate my daily life, and I suddenly didn't have all that much time for YouTube. I did try to start a project in the summer, which would involve around 5M uh, as a way to make a... 5M is a third-party GTA 5 multiplayer kind of um, uh, client. And the idea was to make like a TV show out of a video game about cars, guns, and all kinds of fun things. But that didn't work out because A, 5M got axed, and B, um, I just was not able to get the, the functions I needed um, through that, so that kind of went under, and I went back to thinking about my old channel. Recently, I've suddenly become this, um, kind of almost expert on time management, uh, where I suddenly found an extra hour or so every once in a while to just do stuff with, uh, and, uh, I talked to my old contributors from my old channel and kind of pitched the idea of going back, uh, to YouTube, and this is where the dilemma kind of came in. Uh, you've got what I used to do, which is combat arms, which is the crew, things like that, and suddenly my tastes changed so dramatically over the past year that now I'm into racing simulators and things like that, and I don't pay much attention to shooters outside maybe Ghost Recon Phantoms or something like that, or here we go, really intense bet on the final corner in the final lap, lose my car just a little, get a little nervous, and wheel to wheel to the finish line. So, um, Essentially, we were trying to figure out whether or not we should um, move on to a different channel or stay on the old one. And at first, we kind of tried to make a new channel. And by tried, I mean literally for a day. I uploaded a video and realized that everything was not the way it was supposed to be. Um, but really, the, the new channel is called Team Crossroads. It's a reference to the name of our kind of car guy group in real life. Um, and... We didn't really want to be referred to as Russian Freak 09 because A, that's a singular name, and it's weird to have other contributors on a channel that's named after the main video contributor, I guess. Uh, and also the fact that, you know, Russian Freak, it really has nothing to do with the channel anymore. It's just confusing and misleading, so we wanted to get away from that identity. However, starting a new YouTube channel from scratch, you know how it is, a lot of you've tried it, it's tough to get videos out and views and subscribers because you don't show up anywhere in the search bar, nobody knows, nobody cares. 
Uh, and although I'm not, I'm not gonna fight for the numbers. I don't really care how many views or subscribers I, I have, as long as people are happy and as long as people are entertained and the videos are doing good. Um, however, to make people happy and or entertained and or informed, you sort of have to um, to have this. people watching the videos, right? And that's very hard when you have three people watching your videos total. It's like you're speaking to an empty room. Uh, so we decided, okay. Let's go back to the old channel and let's just rebrand the damn thing, make everything Team Crossroads, make the uh, logo and the banner different and everything like that, um, and also consequ consequently get rid of some of the old content because a lot of the old content was either way too ratchet for my tastes, um, and don't get me wrong, I'm still going to be you know swearing back and forth, but you know that, that stuff was a little bit uh, less focused and a little bit less um, professionally kind of outlined um, sort of like this video, actually, ironically enough, like rambling like, like a motherfucker. So removed some of that content and we've, um, kind of cleaned up the playlists and, uh, renovated the channel in an effort to make this kind of a blank, almost a blank slate, um, for this new content. Th my biggest concern right now is that a lot of you guys that are watching this video, sub current subscribers, uh, you guys are used to my combat arms content, you guys are used to my crew content, and none of that's really going to be coming back. So I can imagine you guys are pretty fucking pissed right now. Because first he's gone for a year, and then, oh, yeah, then we're changing everything. I understand. Um, unfortunately, I don't think I could force myself to go back to those games. So the mass exodus of subscribers is expected. I, I understand. It's okay, you know. I, I won't take it personally, obviously. However, if you're interested in this kind of thing, or if you think that you can, you have an idea that you could suggest to me, I will definitely consider it. Um, so any kind of any kind of game that you have in mind, be it shooters or RTS or... Um, racing games, especially. Um, feel free to suggest, and I will definitely consider making videos on it. Um, the stuff in this video are kind of like um, tastes of things to come, and although I suck at Rocket League, I might get Avenator to make some videos on it, because that guy's kind of a legend. Uh, and I don't mean the rank. Um, <laughs> so, uh, that's... It's kind of it's kind of like that. Um, the, the new content, I've got some stuff drawn up already. I have my own agenda. Um... I've got some F1 stuff coming up, uh, guides and things like that, but let me know if uh, you'd like me, for example, to have um, some videos about real-life events in F1, discussing that. Let me know if you want me to go back to my uh, good old channel, or sorry, um, trailer analysis videos, where, you know, I break down trailers of the latest video games. I'm also thinking of going to Need for Speed when that comes out for PC, uh, things like that, but your suggestions are definitely welcome, and I'll try to mash that up with my agenda so that it works. Um, all in all, though, to kind of give you a taste of what's to come, expect videos with this kind of intensity where I'm battling wheel-to-wheel -wheel with Nico Rosberg uh, through Canada, you know, cutting corners and shit. Um, and um, expect lots of guides. Um, expect content fairly regularly because that's the, that's the idea. And expect for some of the old people to make a return. So we've got a couple of new guys that haven't been in my videos before, Avenator and Wheaton. Um, but they've been around, obviously, in my friend group for quite a while. We've also got the good old people, Super Jelly and, um, and God of War, who's rebranded himself as Fuzzy Peach by this point, making a return. And uh, those, uh, specifically Fuzzy Peach, he's um, on Kerbal Space Program. He's doing um, a, a bit of Rust, uh, things like that. So we're all on different games, different platforms. And um, the idea is that there's going to be people contributing to videos other than just me. Uh, lots of behind-the-scenes work and obviously trying to uh, represent the community as well as we can. So feel free to leave any suggestions, um, likes, comments, whatever, but uh, feel free to let the hate pour in if that's what you'd like. Um, but this is, I hope this update helps to really kind of help you understand in which direction the channel's going. Um, and obviously videos will come out fairly regularly, especially because this semester isn't as terrible for me and summer's coming up. Um, so kind of expect more racing sim kind of things from my end at least. The style won't change so much. It'll still be, you know, guides and stuff. Lots of kind of controversial speech and uh, lots of anger and things like that. Um, but hopefully it'll be a little bit more executed and it'll be a little bit more worth your time this time around. Uh, so I hope you enjoyed. I, I appreciate that you sat through this um, thing, if you're still here. And um, feel free to make any suggestions you'd like. I'll consider them all. Um, so yeah, feel free to uh, do that. And... Um, Keep an eye out for videos and other content coming uh, fairly soon. Give the Facebook page for Team Crossroads a like. And um, I'll see you guys soon. Thank you for watching.